Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today I'm diving into something that is critical for anyone involved in the electronics industry or product development. I'm talking about supply chain stability and how component intelligence might just be the secret weapon you've been looking for. Supply chain stability isn't just some corporate buzzword. It is what keeps your production lines running, your customers happy, and your business growing even when the world throws curveballs your way. Let's just think about this, okay? Last few years, bit of a roller coaster for electronics manufacturers and electronics in general. We had pandemic disruptions, chip shortages, geopolitical tensions, logistical nightmares, and those who survived and thrived during all of that were not just lucky. They had systems in place that gave them an edge, and component intelligence was often at the heart of these systems. So what exactly is that though? What is component intelligence and how does it work? And is it really the key to maintaining a stable supply chain in today's unpredictable world? That is exactly what we are going to explore today. Okay, let's start with the basics, right? What exactly is component intelligence? Well, at its core, component intelligence is the complete spectrum of technical and inventory data associated with electronic components. Easy, right? It's essentially just having access to all of the critical information you need about the parts that make up your products. Component intelligence aggregates vital details like specifications, data sheets, life cycle status, availability, pricing, compliance information, all that stuff all into one place. Think of it like having a sort of digital crystal ball it gives you complete visibility into the components that make your products work. Instead of seeing just what happens today, component intelligence platforms help you understand historical patterns and predict future trends that might impact your supply chain. So companies like Silicon Expert and Z2 Data are examples of platforms that serve as powerful hubs for this information. They are constantly analyzing millions of data points across components, suppliers, and markets to give you access actionable insights. And if you don't have these insights, when the next thing happens, the next chip shortage, the next whatever, you're going to be completely unprepared. And who knows what sort of terrible calamities could occur if you are completely unprepared. Now that we understand a little bit about what component intelligence is, let's break down the key aspects that make it so powerful for supply chain stability. And there are five critical elements to comprehensive component intelligence. First, there's the technical data, right? This is detailed specifications that ensure that components will actually work in your designs. This is gonna include things like uh, detailed specifications covering electrical characteristics, mechanical dimensions, um, environmental ratings, stuff like that. Having access to comprehensive technical data means your engineering team can make informed decisions from the start, reducing the risk of design errors and enhancing overall reliability. Second key aspect here is stocking and inventory data. This is real-time information that helps you understand what's available and where it's available from. This kind of data is gold for procurement teams it includes information on stock levels, lead times, supplier locations. All this enables you to avoid shortages that could derail production. In today's volatile market, probably tomorrow's volatile market as well, this kind of visibility can be the difference between meeting customer deadlines and missing them entirely. Third critical aspect is life cycle status, knowing where components stand in their product life cycle. Now, this is particularly important for long-term planning. Component intelligence provides insights into whether a component is active, obsolete, or nearing end of life. I have seen so many companies get caught in a nightmare scenario where they discover some critical component is going end of life <laughs> after they've already designed it into a product that's planned with a 10-year life cycle. Huge problem. That's the kind of supply chain stability killer that component intelligence helps you to avoid. Fourth key element, pricing information. Accurate data that helps you control costs and your budget effectively. It's gonna allow you to estimate your costs really well, make cost-effective decisions, not waste money. Component intelligence platforms provide up-to-date pricing from multiple suppliers, so this enables you to compare, negotiate for better deals if you want to. And in this kind of hashtag volatile market, I think that's the recurring theme of this video, this kind of insight really does help you manage your budget well, even when component prices are fluctuating wildly. Finally, there is compliance information. This is critical data that helps you meet regulatory requirements and avoid legal issues. This ensures compliance 
with industry standards like Rojas Reach and all the others. By accessing compliance information, you can avoid potential fines, promote sustainability, and enhance the marketability of your products as customers increasingly prioritize environmentally friendly and ethically sourced products. All right, so we've talked a little bit about component intelligence. Let's zoom out a little bit and talk about supply chain resilience and why that actually matters. Supply chain resilience is the ability to anticipate, prepare for, respond to, and recover from disruptions in the supply chain. In the electronics industry, these disruptions can come from various sources, natural disasters, geopolitical tensions, supplier bankruptcies, pandemics, you name it. There's a ton of things that can disrupt the supply chain. So it's not just about surviving those disruptions, it's about maintaining continuity of operations regardless of what is happening throughout the world. I mean, think about the companies during the pandemic that were able to continue delivering products uh, during the height of everything being shut down. They were not lucky, they had a good plan and they made a lot of money because of that plan. A truly resilient supply chain has several key elements and component intelligence plays a critical role in each of them. So what are those key elements? Well, first you got predictive analytics, right? You need advanced technologies to forecast challenges before they impact your operations so that you can adjust to what's going to come. Using AI, machine learning, predictive analytics can forecast demand patterns, spot potential disruptions and optimize inventory levels. The quality of these predictions really depends heavily on the quality of data you're feeding into your systems, as is the case with all AI stuff, and that's where component intelligence comes in. It provides rich, accurate data to power your predictive models. The second element is intelligent procurement, leveraging AI and data to make smarter buying decisions. Now, AI-driven systems make procurement easier because they evaluate suppliers, they check product quality, they negotiate contracts more efficiently. Again though, the effectiveness of these systems does rely heavily on having comprehensive up-to-date information about component suppliers and market conditions, and that is exactly what component intelligence provides. Before we keep going, if you are finding this deep dive on component intelligence informational, entertaining, perhaps enlightening, if your life has been changed by it, um, subscribe. Back to the video. Now let's look at how component intelligence impacts quality control in the supply chain. This is a critical factor for stability and customer satisfaction. Now quality control systems powered by component intelligence, they help to identify potential issues before they become costly problems. AI powered machine vision systems are used for real time quality control, inspecting components with precision and speed beyond human capability. Component intelligence feeds these systems with detailed specifications and quality parameters they need to accurately identify issues, ensuring that only components that meet your exact requirements make it into your products. Another crucial element for supply chain stability is adaptive production planning. Planning. This is the ability to adjust manufacturing processes in real time. AI systems continuously learn from real time data to adjust manufacturing processes dynamically. This ensures optimal production efficiency and allows for swift responses to unforeseen challenges and the effectiveness of adaptive production planning, say it with me, <laughs> depends on having comprehensive real time information about component availability, lead times and potential disruptions that's exactly what component intelligence provides. Man, it really seems like there's a theme with good information and quality outputs from AI. Now, supply chain visibility, that's another critical factor for maintaining stability, and it is an area where component intelligence really does shine. You need advanced tracking systems, data analytics, enhanced visibility, traceability throughout the entire supply chain, right? This minimizes the risk of counterfeiting. It enables quick identification of defects, stuff like that. Component intelligence platforms facilitate this visibility by aggregating data from multiple sources and providing a single source of truth for all component related information. Now, geographic diversification is a powerful strategy for supply chain stability that's enabled by component intelligence. Forward-thinking companies diversify their supply chains geographically to reduce dependency on a single region and mitigate various risks. Component intelligence makes this diversification strategy possible by providing detailed information about suppliers across different regions, their capabilities, their lead times, their pricing, etc. Okay, so we have explored what component intelligence is, how it relates to various aspects of supply chain resilience, now, let's talk a little bit about how to actually integrate component intelligence with your supply chain strategies to maximize 
your stability. Your first step is gonna be to enhance your predictive analytics capabilities by leveraging the wealth of data that component intelligence platforms provide. By analyzing historical data and real-time information, your AI algorithms can forecast demand patterns and identify potential disruptions with impressive accuracy. The next step is to use component intelligence to streamline procurement and supplier management. This enables your AI-driven systems to evaluate supplier performance, access product quality and negotiate contracts more efficiently. Quality control is another area where component intelligence is going to significantly enhance your supply chain stability. Leverage detailed technical data and compliance information. Then you can use that to ensure that only high quality components that meet industry standards are actually placed into your products. Adaptive production planning, also greatly enhanced by component intelligence. And enhanced supply chain visibility and traceability is perhaps one of the most significant benefits of integrating component intelligence with your supply chain strategies. Component intelligence platforms offer advanced tracking systems and data analytics that ensure visibility throughout the entire supply chain, this is going to enable quick identification of issues so that you can fix it. Okay, so that's the conceptual overview. What about the practical stuff? Let's talk about strategies and best practices for implementing component intelligence to enhance your supply chain stability. First, start with a clear assessment of your current supply chain vulnerabilities. You need to identify the areas where you have experienced disruptions in the past or where you see the potential to experience disruptions in the future. This is going to help you prioritize which aspects of component intelligence to focus on first. Next, select the right component intelligence platform for your needs. You're going to consider factors such as data coverage, integration capabilities with your existing systems, user interface, analytical capabilities, and cost. Now, it's often helpful to start with a pilot project first before committing to full integration. It's really, really crucial that existing systems integrate well here. This maximizes the value of your component intelligence, so pay attention to that. Ensure that your platform can seamlessly integrate with your existing ERP, PLM, procurement systems, that sort of stuff. This enables the automatic flow of data between systems, which eliminates manual processes and reduces the risk of errors. Now, training and change management are also critical here. You wanna ensure that all of your stakeholders understand how to use component intelligence platforms and the value that they provide. Continuous monitoring and improvement are essential for long-term success here as well. So, you know, within this hashtag volatile market, <laughs> as we look to the future, we can expect more hashtag volatile markets. This means that several emerging trends in component intelligence are likely to come, which will further enhance supply chain stability. The integration of AI, right? I've already talked about AI a bunch in this video. It's gonna be even more integrated in the future. Advanced AI algorithms, they are increasingly able to identify really subtle patterns and correlations in component data that might not be apparent to human analysts. Another important trend to look at is the increasing integration of external data sources with component intelligence platforms, including weather data, geopolitical risk assessments, economic indicators, news feeds, stuff like that. Blockchain also makes an appearance here, blockchain technology. It's poised to revolutionize component intelligence by enhancing traceability and authenticity verification. And IoT, Internet of Things, that's another technology that's increasingly being integrated with component intelligence. IoT sensors can provide real-time data on component conditions during transportation and storage, which can be correlated with component specifications to identify potential quality issues before components are used in production. So let's roll back the clock here and answer our original question. Is component intelligence the key to supply chain stability in electronics design teams? Yeah, I think based off what we've been explored, it's certainly one of the keys. Component intelligence provides the foundation of data and insights that enable companies to build truly resilient supply chains capable of understanding any threats that are coming and withstanding those so that they can quickly recover from the disruptions that will come in the volatile market. Now, as is the case with a lot of cybersecurity stuff, you gotta remember here that this is not just a one-time project, it's an ongoing journey of continuous improvement. But by investing in component intelligence and integrating it with your supply chain strategies, you are building a foundation for long-term resilience and success that can stand whatever comes. If you found this exploration of component intelligence and supply chain stability valuable, please hit that like button. Leave a little comment in the comments section down below. Someone will jump on and respond to it. I am sure of that. Thank you so much for watching this video. See you in the next one.